Hello, KTA Tigers. Hello, Miss Snedeker. Hello. Hi, everybody. I hope you're having a great day. Today is Friday, November 4th, 2022. You may see some very um, special friends in the middle school who are dressed in their cheerleader uniforms today. Very special. They look so pretty and beautiful in their awesome KTA um, uniform. So they are doing that to remind everybody that it is time to register for tryouts. The, these are girls who have already registered, so they get an extra chance to show their KTA spirit today. But also, if you have questions about cheer, they have done cheer in the past, so they are the experts. You can ask them, what's it like to be a cheerleader? What do you have to do? What do you have to do at tryouts? Um, but they are there today to answer all of your questions and to pump up some other girls or boys who might be interested in trying out for cheer. So cheer tryouts start at three o'clock on Monday. There will be a clinic on Monday, a clinic on Tuesday, three o'clock to four o'clock, Wednesday practice on your own, and Thursday is the big day where we have tryouts. So if you're interested, please talk to those cheerleaders you see around the middle school today. And remember, it is tryouts for sixth, seventh, and eighth graders. I know I have some elementary friends that are just so excited to be cheerleaders someday, but this is our middle school cheer. So if you're interested, um, talk to them and we'd love to have you try out. And we mm -hmm. have a new KTA Tiger at, at KTA. This is a very friendly bird. So there is a really fun story about how he joined our family. So Miss Logvin was outside with her class. Miss Logvin is a seventh and eighth grade science teacher. And she was outside with her class and this little friend just flew over and started landing on people's shoulders, I think landing on their head, just going from person to person and hanging out with them. And we all know at KTA, we all know the birds don't normally act like this, right? So this was a really, really friendly bird um, and used to being someone's pet. And so, but he didn't have any place to go. And so he came to to our friends at KTA and Miss in Miss Logman's class, so Miss um, Logman held him on her hand and brought her brought him inside, and she got him a cage, and he is so happy. I actually went into she had him in her science lab, and I went in, and he was sitting in his cage on his perch, just as content as can be. Um, and so we're really excited to have him on our campus and um, she's taking great care of him. She has, he, this particular bird is called a budgie and it's actually, I looked it up. It's actually the third most popular pet in the world after mm, cats that's and dogs. Interesting. Yeah. So um, it's in the parakeet family, I think. So, um, so we're just really, I think that's really fun. If you have a chance to visit him, you should. They are, I think, right there having a bird club. Yes, we have started a bird student, club. Yep. Students are helping take care of him and taking turns taking him home on the weekend so he can get cared for. So what a fun addition. I'm sure, I'm sure that we're going to see more of our friend, um, Pet Budgie. But he doesn't have a name yet. And I think Miss Logvin is working with her students to come up with the best name. So I can't wait to find I out know. what his I'm name so is. I'm so excited. Yes. Tillman's yes. already taken. So yeah, Tillman's Tillman. taken. So something yeah. else. Hmm. Something yeah. that reflects KTA. Hmm. I know. We'll see. He even I'm has some stripes on his head. He and does. His, you know. Yeah. Yes. He's got a lot of school spirit. Mm -hmm. My student assistants had some very interesting name suggestions. Miss Logvin, if you would like to talk to any of them, I'm sure they'd be happy to share those with you, but uh, I can't yes. wait to see what his name is going to be. I think Mr. Collins has a really good name suggestion, too. Oh, good. So maybe okay. she should check with him. Yeah. Awesome. Mm -hmm. All right, friends. Oops, wrong screen, wrong screen, wrong screen. There we go. There we go, Miss Good Sedeker. job. Yes, <laughs> sometimes it takes a few tries. Yeah. Well, today is Friday and it is time for Friday Surprise. So we have two people that are going to be honored and they both get a surprise. So if you check your mailboxes today, um, these two staff members, they um, 
there's something special for you. So the seventh and eighth grade core teachers wanted to recognize Miss Kosis, and they said that she, we, you have heard she teaches a very special class called leadership, and they are the class that is raising the eggs and doing some really cool and fun things to learn about responsibility and just being the best middle schoolers you can be. So they wanted to give a shout out for just how amazing those students are and what a good job Miss Kosis is doing um, to help everybody be successful in that class. So they said, thank you for everything you do, Miss Kosis, to help our middle schoolers, and thank you for teaching such an important class. So awesome, awesome. Next up is um, from Mr. Collins, and he wanted to recognize Miss Sheely. He said, Miss Sheely does a great job of supporting middle school students at lunch every day and it is an important role and she does it very well so thank you both so miss Kosas and miss sheely something special you have a friday surprise in your box all right friends i think with that it is time to start our friday so we have a um, moment of inspiration from emma you will see it in a second and then that is going to be followed by our moment of silence kta tiger pledge pledge of allegiance and on with our day of learning so i hope you have a wonderful day go, go tigers, tigers.